Hi, my name is Ryan Mayfield of Mayfield Renewables, and today we're out here at this 2 megawatt ground mount PV array in order to talk to you about insulation resistance testing and how to perform those tests and interpret those results in, in the field so that you can understand if there's anything that you need to do in real time in order to maintain or fix any conductors. So as the name implies, insulation resistance test is looking at the different circuits and looking at the conductors to make sure that the insulation around the wires themselves is in good working order. And so we very often use water as an analogy in our electrical systems. And so this is a lot like pressurizing a water pipe and looking for a leak. And so what we're going to do is you're going to open up our, in this case, our inverter, and we will isolate the different circuits. We will use our insulation resistance tester, put voltage on that wire or on that circuit that will pressurize it. If there's any bad parts of the wire, the electricity, the electrons will find a way to ground and the meter will record that. And so we're going to be able to read the meter, look at what the actual value is of that resistance and be able to make a determination if the conductors are in good shape or not.